So I'm happy to announce that the pre-order for the new Cozy Penguin plushie is now available over at Creator Inc. Just like the gamer penguin that came before, this plushie's design was based off an emote from the stream channel, specifically the Cozy emote. Cuddle up with this comfy plushie as they snuggle into their own trusty blankie. This plushie is about half the size of the previous enormous one, making it the perfect size to display on your desk or on a shelf. Just like last time, this plushie is available as a limited time pre-order over on Creator Inc from now until July 29th. Do note that because this is a limited time pre-order, we are only making as many as we sell, and as such, it will take a few months to produce each one. You can expect to receive your plushie sometime around early October. Also, we are offering an early bird special to anyone who pre-orders the plushie in the first week. Just click the link in the description or check YouTube's merch shelf and enter code EARLYPENGUIN15 at checkout to get 50% off your purchase. Previously on Persona 5 Strikers. Why is that? Wasn't she angry at Alice? Well, see, she let out her anger by beating the crap out of her. And then Alice let out that anger by beating the shit out of her too, so she died like 30 times. As did we all. See, that's the beautiful cycle of vengeance, Sophia. This is humanity great. And now back to... Summer Vacation with the Phantom Thing! Hello! Sneak up B! Back with some more Persona 5 Strikers. We last left off, we defeated Alice once and for all, and the game's over. All right, bye guys, see you later. I'll see y'all Persona 6, maybe. Probably not though, bye. I'm just kidding. Our adventure has just fucking begun, because we about to go on a road trip, son. It's gonna be, it's gonna be interesting, because I'll be curious to see how they handle this, because now we're actually gonna be leaving, seemingly leaving this city, which makes me wonder, will we be seeing other cities? Will we have like other hub areas? Uh, how different is it going to get? Or is it just going to be like, oh, I can just hop around to someplace like just going to the map here and boom, I'm there. And it's like hop into a dungeon, go to that place. But I still like, this is still my hub area. I, I don't know. I'll be curious to see how they handle it. And also, is it going to be linear? It sounds like we are going to be meeting in a specific location, but along the way, we're going to, you know, take care of some other, uh, jails that have also been popping up lately, right? So it makes me wonder, do I have a choice? Will it be just specifically in this order? I, I imagine probably still in a specific order because otherwise it'd probably involve them having to scale the game based on whatever, which whenever you do first, right? But we'll see. I, I don't know. I'm just kind of curious to see if they end up like sort of trying to spice it up a little bit. But it was good. Uh, I definitely will say that fight with Alice was fucking tough. <laughs> it was tough as nuts. Uh, and I used so many items. I'm going to have to seriously stock up on items in this game. This is a... Uh, Ooh, yeah. I guess it's, it's pretty normal to, to use up a lot of items um, during these boss fights because, like, I really wasn't having too much problem with the regular enemies. So I was so, so surprised that the uh, the boss fights in particular really beat your ass into the fucking ground, dude. Especially, like, the tougher enemy fights, right? And then, like, the specific fights, like the, the one where we got the key from uh, or that bully fight. And then Alice herself, which was like, Jesus. And I almost was wondering if there was like something I was missing because she kept doing that move that spun in circles and just just did it non-stop and hit my party members just for so much damage and I'm like damn like what do I do can I block it I don't know there's a block in this right there's I guess maybe Yusuke's like his counter maybe would have helped for that I was thinking there must have been like some gimmick I was missing to like knock her out of it because it was just so powerful and she did it so often in her second phase but uh, seemingly like just sort of a battle of endurance. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see, uh, how things progress. But if that first fight was that hard, I can only imagine it's just going to get way mm. tougher from here on. But yes, uh, Zenkichi has now tasked us with, uh, going around and, uh, helping with some of these additional monarchs that have been occurring throughout, uh, I guess all of Japan, right? <laughs> Listen, man, I hope it's only in Japan. If it's, out, if it's outside of this country, we're going to have a problem because I'm a high school student. You think I make the big bills or some shit? You know, and I count kind of that one time I abused the game last in Persona 5 and got like a million yen. Or was it, I think, wait, was that the one I got? It was, yeah, actually it was. And I, I remember what fight it was. It was like a random request where, I think it was like suggested that the wife was like a gold digger or something like that. And if you like steal, like you confuse the the husband and he like throws one yen at you showing he has like no money. And then the lady throws money at you and she throws a ton of money, I think. I think that's how that worked. I think I remember someone telling me that I actually got patched out of the, <laughs> out of Persona 5 Royal. Damn, I love I love that though. It was so much you get so much money from that. But now I'm broke. All that sweet sexy money I had in that game is didn't carry over. Now I'm stuck with $267. What must I do with that? But yeah, it seemed like Zinkichi was 
I don't know. His reaction to going to the metaverse for the first time did seem genuine. Like, it didn't seem like he was lying. So I am more sort of like more believing that he couldn't, he maybe isn't like already someone with uh, persona powers and hasn't already been to the metaverse and is fucking shit up like a catchy was. I'm also just thinking, I just wouldn't think they would do the same exact plot point they did before, right? That'd be mm. kind of dumb. So I think for now, I'm just gonna trust that Zinkichi is not a crazy psycho asshole, or at least hope he isn't. Which if that is the case, that means at some point he is gonna be getting persona powers, which is uh, gonna be interesting. I don't, I don't know exactly what that's going to play into, but it also really just made me wonder why the f Fuck, is that something that they spoil in the intro of this game? That's such a, if that's the case, right? If it's the case that I uh, didn't have Persona Powers or something, now nah, and he's gonna maybe get them later on. Why would they spoil that? That would have been such a cool surprise. Like that was clearly him in the intro. I don't believe that. Oh, that could have been someone else. No, that was definitely him. <laughs> definitely a weird design choice in my opinion, but whatever. Anyway, uh, last episode, uh, Luna Prox said, uh, Senkichi, how do you do fellow kids? <laughs> I just have heard that and immediately heard Stu Buscemi's voice in Zinkichi. And I was like, yeah, that sounds about right. How old is he even supposed to be? Do I actually have like a... Actually, I don't think I do. It's like a profile or anything in this, is there? He's not that old. I don't think he's that old. Is he, what is he, in like his late 30s, early 40s? I don't imagine he's in his fucking 50s. If he were in his 50s, Japan would be like, dude, you are like... You have one foot in the grave at this point. But yeah, as for at this point, kind of what Zinkichi's become. He's just like, like, hey, guys, I'm hip too. I get what those phantom thieves are, are all up about, bitch. Isn't that right, player? Joker's like, don't you call me that. Those are our words. The words of the you. You an old timer. We're gonna grab your cane and get out of here. I find it funny that Japan is seemingly like very uh, reverential of their elderly, but at the same time, also like so quick to just be like, oh yes, this person's in their 40s. They're old now, old. You about to die today, boy? Hell, I think even to them, like, even like the late 20s, early 30s is like, like, oh damn, you were getting up there, dude. Fuck you, Japan, all right? It's like a plenty of youth in me. <laughs> but anyway, little proc, thank you so much for your incredibly accurate comment. And it is for that reason you are comment of the day. Uh, by the way, as it clarifies, so, no, the shadows actually do not, are uh, the, uh, people who have palaces actually do not remember what their shadows say. Even Shido didn't actually know what was going on specifically with us. It was, uh, he just knew about the existence of the metaverse and was making use of it. But did he actually have the memories that his shadow did? He didn't. Okay, I actually didn't realize that. I don't think I even realized when I played it, because it just seemed like he, like, knew what was going on exactly. Like, like I remember a point where he, like, realized they defeated his shadow and he, like, took, like, matters into his own hands, all right? I can't remember if he was like trying to kill himself or something, but so I, I sort of assumed that was him like, oh, I, I have those memories, but I guess it was more he just sensed that it, like his, he's like, oh shit, I'm having a change of heart, fuck this shit. All right, so now Alice is dead. We still got other people to go handle. Uh, so I tend to visit our old house for a while. Oh, I want to go up there and buy items, honestly. I said, I have like nothing. I have fucking nothing after that fight. Seriously, how many healing items? I've got one of the devil fruit. Five of these are just good. I think I think I might have gotten these on sale. And wait, or did I? I don't know. Three of the hundred ones, which I thankfully didn't use. I got a few things, but I had so much more than this at the start. All more reason to still go to the vending machine, which actually now I'm gonna wonder if I don't come back here, or if I happen to be going out and about, and I don't come back here, will I get new vending machines to go shop at? Is that how this is gonna go? Hmm? I'm gonna buy some, yes. Always, always. Now I'll do my laundry because I'm all sweaty and shit after all that murder man. Oh my God, I hear you're on a road trip. Oh, I'm gonna miss you so much, Nico. I know, I'm gonna miss you too, whatever your name is. I mean, uh, dedicated woman. Oh my God, you remember my name. Oh, I love you so much. I love you too, girl. Mm -hmm. Regardless, like, ew, really? Well, that's what happens, Morgana, when you don't have any actual relationship mechanics in a game. It means I can be as degenerate as I want to be without any consequences. <laughs> all right, Ryuji, what's up? Yo. Hey, I've been waiting for you. Up to grab some ramen right now? I'll be at you, at you know where. Let's celebrate for getting the band back together and setting off this big trip. Let's we go. What are waiting for then? You gonna go right now? I think you're a little obsessed. That a problem. Hey, if you're not doing anything, you should come with. Hmm, I don't know if I want all the calories. Yeah, let's go. Well, I guess I'll come along since Nico's here. All right, shooting trios off. Interesting. Damn 
understand. It's just the bomb. That's what I'm talking about. Ryuji, nobody says the bomb anymore. You're starting to sound like a boomer, all right? Oh, no. Did you just turn 20 and not tell me about it? That means you're going to die, Ryuji. Don't you know? This is what I'm talking about, dude. No ramen, no life. <laughs> You're a treat, right? You seem happy. It brings me back. <laughs> Any little musical notes? What's going on here? Nikki, you haven't eaten this for what? Half a year? Must be happy reunion. Oh, yeah. You really love ramen that much? Well, it is good, though. Right? I could eat this forever. Man, eating this reminds me of the original fam thieves. Back when it was just us three. Hey. Me and us four? I was there too, you know. Man, shut up, Morgana. Yeah, shut up, Morgana. You don't count. You didn't get a cool anime Persona Awakening moment. You just had yours right off the bat. That's boring. You're boring. Get out of here. Man, why are you guys going to be so mean to me all the time? God, I swear to God, it's done it. Here, shut up and have some tuna. All right, I'm going to eat the tuna, but I'm still pissed at you. I remember you ate too much and I feel like crap. You were the same way. Bloop. Oh, God damn it. It's probably hey. Sophia. Hey, show me the ramen. Look. Oh, so this is what ramen is. Okay, again, you have access to the internet. Why don't you know what it is? Aren't you supposed to be like Siri in human form? Looks good, right? Too bad you can't try it. They got extra large large ones, too. You won't believe how much stuff they put in. I want to see. Oh. Huh? I want to see some extra large ramen. I'm going to throw her in a bowl in there in a second. Let's see if this thing is actually waterproof. Oh, but splash. Sure, Ryuji. For real? For real? No way, I just had a bowl. So that's the story. You said you could eat it forever. Do, do it for Sophia. Oh, what if put me on the spot? Awesome. Fine, challenge accepted. But I'm taking you guys with me. Hey, boss, let's take three extra bowls over here. Oh, that's right. You better get fucked up. What? Seriously? Oh, God. Oh, my God. Dude, what the fuck? Do bowls like that exist? They just... M oh, my. That's so oh much no. noodles. Can't. No. Blah, blah. Why? Why did you do this to me, Sophie? I'm gonna be you. My stomach feels like it's about to burst. I gotta take the biggest dump, dude. Are you guys done with your shenanigans? That was nothing. You see that, Sophia? I'm down for one more. Let's get another one. Are you crazy? Dude, I ate the big ba I beat the big bang burger challenge. You forget Ryuji? Do you have any idea how many calories that thing was? And I attempted it many times. Many, many times. I mean, to be fair, I'm probably gonna die in my early 20s, so. So I guess there's some truth to that Japanese saying. Woo. Thank you. I learned a lot from that. Did you now? No, I just wanted to see you suffer. That's what I thought. It's good to hear. <laughs> I need to lie down. You think they have any hammocks here? Enjoy ramen to the full extent with An and Ryuji. Oh! We do kind of get social links. Sort of. <laughs> kind of. I don't know if my decision really had any impact on it. I didn't get any like, additional musical notes. Maybe it determines how much you get at the very end? Maybe? But it didn't like... I feel like if that were the case, it would have given me an indication of like before where musical notes pop up when you pick the good one. Ugh, I definitely can wait after that. Oh man, easy on the road or else I'll come back up. Dude, are you psyched? Sight? He's a ride in an actual freaking RV this summer. I have a feeling life is going to get a lot rougher for Alice in a bunch of ways. But I know there are people out there who have looked up to her well before she started all this, all this and lost her way. Those people are gonna be so pumped when she makes her comeback. That's why I hope she doesn't just give up on her dreams. Dude, she's going to jail. <laughs> we don't gonna see her crazy ass again. You're so kind. Sounds pretty tough. You keep that too on. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I've gotta really get a, gotta up my game too. Oh, sorry. I didn't mean all sappy right before we leave and everything. I'm really pumped to get this to take this trip with everyone. Better make the most of it, right? <laughs> Ta-da! I brought a whole bunch of games. Let's play some of it when we have the time for it. Uh, travel game set. <laughs> Mine? Yeah. It's an actual accessory? A set of games to play on your road trip that will make the time fly by. It also gives me plus two endurance to put up with your crazy bullshit. With all these shenanigans. Endurance, that's probably pretty good for Ryuji then, right? I mean, he's already, like, Ryuji's clearly supposed to be like the tank, right? Because he can just beef so much damage. And endurance <laughs> is the, uh, is like your defense, right? If I remember how these that things work. Oh my god, look how close, close I am to this fucking move. Yeah, Ryuji has the most endurance by a lot. Uh, actually, I probably should give it to the person with the least amount of endurance. No, I already have something on her, I, I think. Wait, do I? Oh, I don't. Alright. 
That's for you. Buddy on, so you don't die as quickly. All right, five more points. Okay, well, that's cool. I, I'm glad I actually see that at least there's sort of some social links. At least moments where you just hang out with your pals. It's a little thing, but it's something. It's better than nothing for certain. All right, I think I should probably work on getting this. Here's the effect of healing items. Because clearly, he healing items are going to be fucking good in this game. Fucking useful. What game should we kick things off? The the game of strife, Juno. <gasps> oh, what about Jenga? While we're moving, <laughs> Jenga, uh, Uno, and the game of life. Uh huh. I got it. I got all the references. Bus for us. Go to the batting cages. No! Trying to use bigs and RV is a first for me. I mean, I'm at least a little bit nervous. She's the only one with actual license. I'm still looking forward to it. I've wanted to go on a long road trip for some time now. Don't worry, I won't gun it like with Johanna. Hey, baby cakes, hope you hope you and I are going to cuddle up together on the ride there. What? No! What? Hey. That was weird. We may have to fo focus our efforts on the case, but I'm still excited for our trip. I'm extra glad I asked for some time off at the company now that all this has come together. <laughs> I hope we all have a great time. Isn't this supposed to be a long excursion, though? Better stock up as best I can. Listen, well, Nari, you only get 500 yen for snacks for now, for now okay? Impossible. What? But rocks also not a snack, yes. It's <laughs> all right. Nar uh, Yusuke can he can go a long, a long way with just that much money. All right. Damn, this shit is so expensive. Why is it so expensive? I mean, it is pretty damn good, but it's also so expensive. Fuck it. Thank you. Splurging. All right, we're going on a road trip. I get one chance to splurge. I gotta buy some of this really cheap shit. Hell, even the HP, HP stuff is actually going to be useful. Oh, Ooh, a tobacco store. Redline, this is legal for Myers to smoke cigarettes. Am I even a minor at this point? I, wait, am I 18 yet? Am I? At this point, I should be able to smoke if I want to. Either way, get the hell off my case, all right? Let me make my bad decisions, Sophie. If I want to short my lifespan even further, that's my prerogative. Any house students think sketchy get that popular? Since I go, the boys clash back to normal. Thank God. Fuck. Oh, guys, listen to these two. Shit, did I really spend much on Alice? What the fuck, dude? You finally realize? Man, you've always been like this. Once you find a girl you like, you've been in everything else. Well, fine, I'll let you with what, what you need. You fucking simp. <laughs> Damn it. I was hoping you'd say that again. Told you you was a simp. You simp. You're gonna die. Check it out. That's super recommended. That is super, super hot. Oh my God. That's what you're getting. Thanks for your gifts, but oh my god, you get the shit. It cures your brainwash and also fucks you up. Thanks. It sounds like the, it's like the receptionist from uh, AS Omnifiles works here. Oh my god, holy shit, what Hi, the fuck? Welcome. What are you doing? Why are you still talking to me? But why are you buy my stuff? Yeah, but blah, 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 blah. Just give me everything. Give me some of everything. I can't get enough now. Especially the Big Bang Burger, bitch. Bitch. I think I'm stocked up pretty well in healing items now. Still seems to be only one vending machine currently that gives me uh, SP items. All right, I think we're good. I can't stop shout with Sophie at the moment, so. Ah, right, daddy, time for me to say goodbye. <laughs> Feels like I just saw you again and now we're leaving. I miss you so much, daddy. Why don't you come on the trip with us? About to roll out? Yeah, see ya. All right, well here, take this with you. Hope it does see some good on the trip. Roadmap? Make sure you make enough for, for everyone. Oh, fuck me. What? Is there a cookie mini game or something? Well, time for me to pick up your ride. I'll be back. You give everyone a call and have them meet you here. They're literally like right around the corner. So, you know. Guys, we're leaving. You sure you kids going to be okay on your own? We'll be fine. I mean, probably. Take care, boss. Uh, same to you. Be careful out there. I love you, daddy. Bye. Please, don't forget me, Daddy. You know we're just going to be fighting demons this whole time, right? Yeah. We ain't doing anything. You look unusually serious, Inspector Hasegawa. Oh, God. Oh, Commissioner Kaburagi. My apologies. I've been short on sleep. I've not been on an undercover case in quite some time. Also kind of fucked up by this shit I saw the last few days. I wholly understand. Have you liaised with the Phantom Thieves? Affirmative. I've gained their cooperation. 
However, proceedings are touch and go. Some of them are also very quick on the uptake. Nevertheless, I guarantee you that I will win them over. Understood. As expected from someone so dependable. Well, I still owe you for taking me under your wing. I'm happy to do whatever you require. Keep at it until you get to the bottom of this case. But do not get too attached to them. At this point, their arrest is an inevitability. Attached? I haven't been attached to anything in a long time. So you say. And how's the girl? Go home. At least every so often. Understood? Ma'am. Ooh. The girl, huh? No way she's buying anything about that world. I've got to wring a lead out of them. Don't take it personally, Phantom Thieves. All I want is for this case to be solved. And I'll use you however I have to. I knew you are a piece of shit after all. Never mind, fuck you. Take all the last thing I said about you back. Maybe you're not a bad guy or a villain like Ketchy. You're just a douche. He's a fucking douche. On the road again, or I guess for the first time, not Yo, in a... Where are we now? Fucking mementos. On the road again. It's a lot of highways. And oh my God, Fut Futaba's got a, a massive manga. Looks like we're coming up on Tochigi Prefecture. We've come a pretty long way. Oh my God, this place really does look like a 70s dot on the inside. You guys work, your guys work hidden. Jesus. Or an 80s dot. Tochigi is famous for the Nikko Toshogu Shrine, dedicated to Tokugawa Ieyasu. Oh, damn, some good chill music right here. Oh, shit. I'm vibing with this. Oh, oh, yeah. Oh, oh, yeah, yeah. I heard the monkey sculptures there are adorable. I wonder if we'll get to see them. Oh, my God, you say monkeys? I love monkeys. Ooh, I want strawberries. <gasps> Let's go strawberry picking. No, fuck your strawberries. I want to see the monkeys. Apparently, Gyo's is pretty big there, too. Utsunomi is supposed to be the place for it. You say Gyoza? Oh, hell yeah. We're going to get some, right? The dry gourd is famous too. Don't roll out the strawberries. Let's not forget the ramen. Sorry, the dry gourd. Of all the things to get excited about. Hey, shut up, Morgana. What do you like? Oh, that's right. Cat shit. Now shut up and eat your tuna again. Oh, it's understandable. We could all use some time to unwind every now and then. And besides, we've already discussed it. We could just go straight to Hokkaido. But we decided it would be more worthwhile to check out a variety of places rather than just one. And there might be jails in other cities besides Shibuya and Sapporo. Not only that, but the supposed monarch of Sapporo won't even be in town till the 8th. <laughs> We're gonna pull up at a 7-Eleven, get some gas, and the fucking 7-Eleven owner's like, I'm fucking crazy, Pats! Ah! Ah! These deals are insane! Try and stop me, man, of these! Ah! Damn, man, I just, just wanted to grab some beef jerky. Why you gotta do me like that, man? We have the time. There's no reason we shouldn't make use of it. Let's take our time. We should pay. No, I gotta say, I gotta say, guys. Guys, I'm about to say it. I'm about to say my tagline. Here we go. <gasps> I should have the wrong one. I guess you have a point. Wait, say we find a jail before then. Does that mean we're sort of hunting for monarchs along the way? Oh, we're taking the Phantom Thieves to a whole new level. This is starting to feel real badass. Oh, yeah. Phantom Thieves go on tour, baby. If there is a jail, I'm sure Sophia will let us know. Leave that to me. I should be able to handle it. I think. No, 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 Sophia. There's no I think on this magic school bus, right? It's I can, motherfucker. I can, motherfucker. That's my girl. You'd think the AI would be a little more sure of herself. Yeah, seriously. Who or what are you? I'm humanity's companion. There she goes singing again. <laughs> Don't think too hard about it. I'm sure we'll learn more if she sticks around. Isn't that right, Sophia? That's right, Aun. Oh, that reminds me, Mako-chan. You've been driving this whole time. Are you doing okay? I have my license too, so I could always drive if you want. Well, you just got yours, Haru, so I'll try to handle as much of the driving as I can. Does anyone else have their license? I don't. I think I just saw Edgeworth drive by. Apologies, I do not. Me neither. I want to get mine soon, though. Do you have one? Sorry, nope. I'm a last two. Damn it! I can't. I can't lie and say yes. Nope. 
Well, I guess we did just reach driving age. Sorry, Mako-chan. Don't push yourself too hard, okay? I won't. Although we might be taking more breaks. I wouldn't want to put any of us at risk. That's fine by me. We want our Makoto to stay nice and well rested. So you're going to keep driving, Makoto? I think so. For the time being. That sounds difficult. Is there anything I can do to help? Well, since you've asked, do you think you could find a place to stop and rest? She's gonna play some death metal to keep her awake. I could probably use a break. We can have lunch there, too. Okay, I'd be happy to. There's a riverbank up ahead that should be perfect. Oh, shit. Guys, we're taking our van down by the river. <laughs> oh, thank God. I've been waiting to say that shit. Lunch by a river, huh? Oh, man, this is feeling like a real road trip. <gasps> Little Bond. Yo, this spot is perfect. This is this even real? I've only ever seen this kind of place online. Seriously. Ugh. And this is the perfect weather for cooking outdoors, too. Skinny dipping, guys. Let's go. <laughs> Rip my clothes off leap in there. Woo! Plus, plus nobody joining me. Shall we get started, then? Boss gave us some ingredients, didn't he? <laughs> oh, this is going to be so nice. Cooking lunch with everyone. What the hell? Enables the creation of more food for stronger effects. What's happening? All right. We'll leave the main course to you. What makes you think I can cook shit? Oh my god, what's happening? At the hideout, you can use ingredients to cook food. These dishes can restore HP and SP or grant buffs, among other powerful effects. Oh my god, I've got an apron on. You will be able to cook more dishes as you learn recipes. You can obtain recipes from regional shops or through certain events, so make sure you keep an eye out. Oh, fuck me. Let's go. <gasps> LeBlanc Curry. That's true. I can't make that. I am quite, I'm quite good at that. Oh, wait. Uh, so LeBlanc Curry. LeBlanc Coffee. The SP restoring items. Oh, oh, shit. You hear that sizzle, baby? Yes, yeah, so I'm going to put my coffee in a pot and I'm going to, and I'm going to boil it. Got to make that shit simmer. <laughs> That's cute. Joker's Kitchen. Short order cook. I think we have a winner. Fuck yeah, it smells great. This looks pretty good. Got it. Nobody eat it though. It's SP. That's Soji Rose Curry, no doubt. Oh, my stomach. I need. I have a great need. The rice has been prepared. We're ready whenever. Use case off tasting around. Just put it on the table, damn it. Mm -hmm. Oh, it's so good. I could eat this forever. I still actually have not had regular curry. <laughs> I've never actually had like this, like th what they call curry here, which I guess is like curry and rice or something. I never, I've never actually had it. All right. I've had other things that have the spice curry in it, but never had the thing that is like the meal that is actually called curry before, which I know is probably a sin. Indeed. And to be surrounded by nature and all its splendor makes it taste that much better. There more. Is there actually meat in it? I guess, actually, I guess there is. I, I literally just put meat in there. <laughs> Sorry, Nari. The great phantom thief Futaba just swiped the very last plate. Last? Plate is cool. Dude, your plate is still full of shit. Oh, come on. Don't act so depressed. It's not like it's the end of the world. I'll make it again. Don't worry, Yusuke. You will. Please do. Do it right now! What are you waiting on? Ah, oh, that was killer. I can't even move. I'm full too. How about I pour us some tea and we can all just relax? I'm down. Ooh, why don't we roast marshmallows later on too? I'm just ready to we'll wait for some crazy guy to leap out from behind the van and be like, Booga, booga, booga! I'm a monarch! Booga, booga! Runs away. We're like, damn it. Seriously, still thinking about food? What of it? There's always room for sweets. All right, we'll finish our break with some tea and sweets, then get going. Everyone enjoy their lunch. <gasps> More bonding. Oh, yeah. Oh, sick. Can't stop bonding. I feel like we've been on the road for a while. Where are we now? We'll be entering Sendai soon. We made a lot of stops, but no sign of any jails, huh? 
Well, I'm definitely feeling a little more relaxed now. I wouldn't want those things popping up everywhere. Also, it's getting kind of dark. How about we call it a day? Yes, we should decide where we want to stay for tonight. Shouldn't we eat first? Uh, what's good in Sendai? As far as local delicacies go, there's always beef tongue. There's plenty of specialty shops around. Nonsense. Galicia says that sounds. We must go to Mount Aoba Park and see the remains of Sendai Castle. They house a statue of the late Lord Date Masamune. I'd very much like to see the one-eyed dragon for myself. Majima? Uh, I want to take a bath first. I'm not sleeping in the camp or all sweaty and sticky. Jeez, we're all over the place on this one. Um, well, what should we do? I've got to go pee! Everyone calm the fuck down! <laughs> calm down! Rock, paper, scissors? We're gonna do all of it. This is where I come in. Okay, so we're down now. Searching. Overnight parking lots, beef tongue, Date Masamune, and nearby bathhouses. Leave it to me. I'll find the most efficient route to everything you've suggested. Wow, you can do all that, Sophia? Of course, I am a god. It's nothing special. I'm just doing a wide search and lining up our destinations. We should first head to the parking lot at Mount Alba Park. Then we can walk to the statue of Masamune. Huh? Huh? Uh-oh. Hmm? What's up? The smell. There might be a jail here. Ah, oh, come on. I was joking, Sophia. You can really tell just off that, huh? Are you sure, Sophia? I think so. I can't pinpoint it yet, and that may be because of the distance. But this feels the same as Shibuya. Sendai it is. All right then, we're heading to Sendai. We shouldn't be too much longer. Just gonna walk in, the whole town's on fire. Sophia, can you smell the jail? Yes, I'm sure of it. There's a jail somewhere in this city. So there really are more jails besides the one in Shibuya? If there's a jail, then something rotten's going on around town. You're right. We'll need to look into that first. And how are we supposed to do that? Sendai's a pretty big city, after all. We could check some more of the popular sightseeing spots. We might hear something if there's people around. Great thinking. And what's more, we're right here in Mount Aoba Park, home to the statue of Lord Masamune. Dude, you can check out the statue tomorrow. I'm starving. No, I want to see it now. Excuse me. There's no guarantee the statue will still be here come sunrise. What? A trip is a once in a lifetime experience. Once you've set a plan, you must act on it without delay. Yes, without delay or without any thought. Ah, <sighs> there he goes. I'll never understand that logic of his. But seriously, why, why would the statue disappear? I'm very confused by that. Uh, what, what are you talking about, Yusuke? By the way, Mako-chan, did you find out if it's okay for us to sleep in the car tonight? Yes, I actually just got confirmation. At least we won't have to worry about finding a place to sleep. And it looks like there are lots of sightseers here, so we should have plenty of chances to ask around. Just a heads up, guys. I do sleep naked, so it might get a little awkward. Should we check out the statue? It's only a short walk from here, right? It's close. Very close. And let us depart. Lord Masamune awaits. Am I actually going to be moving around? Oh, shit! So, this is Mount Alba Park. I like it. Nice, refined little place. It's even got a shrine. All right, let's go check out Date Masamune's statue. It's supposed to be uh, near here. Holy shit on a stick. We are actually moving around in a brand new location. Oh my God, this is actually super cool. It's not just going to be sticking around the same old, uh, same old. And seemingly I'm not just like, no, I'm not like, I can't just automatically hop back there. Oh, I'm actually, I'm actually really thrilled about that. I'm, I'm super thrilled about that. Let's go. Let's go ahead. Let's go to the statue. Everyone left me behind. That was kind of cute. I also like the, just seeing this like, it's like a little rest area, basically, right? Let's go. Uh oh, the Zunda Moki Moki shop. I guess can I, I can shop here at some point. 
It's got a shop icon. Let's go. Shut up, Mario. Go to sleep, nigga. God damn it. Never let me have any fun. This is my vacation. Can I at least get the vending machine? Oh my God. I won't even let me do that. Morgana, I'm going to strangle you. Fine. Be that way. Going to the statue. You happy now? Wow, it is a cool statue. Oh, so this is it. This is that Masamune statue Inari was going on and on about. I'm guessing this is a statue that actually exists, right? He looks so cool. I bet he'd be cutting down shadows left and right if he were in a jail with us. Hope it doesn't turn to a boss fight later. Such remarkable craftsmanship. It's truly the one-eyed dragon in all his glory. Oh, I see, I see posters over there. That's probably related to what we're looking for. I'm touched. How majestic. It's so cool. How majestic. Isn't it? Indeed. I should have expected as much from such an icon. We must come back during the day. And... Hmm? Oh, yeah. What the hell? What's all this about? Prince of Nightmares, Volume 1. 20th reissue celebration? Reissue celebration? So they're... Promoting a book? I doubt they got permission to do this. Maybe it's some kind of prank. Yeah, it looks kind of like Ryuji with horns. What a reprehensible miscreant. Putting up such tasteless flyers for their own gain. Yeah, I feel like this is... It's got to be violating some kind of laws, right? <laughs> not be putting your posters or blemishing our beautiful historical statues. Let's take them down. <sighs> That's better. Well, you happy, Yusuke? Yes. Now that I've seen the great Masamune, my apologies for taking so much of everyone's time. Let's move on. All right, that's one item off the list. Next up, Deep Tone City. <laughs> Let's see if these local flavors are enough to impress a sophisticated palate like mine. I wonder if tongue is good. I don't know, man. It's actually like like slimy or like the consistency of like a tongue like our tongue actually I mean, animal tongue is probably smoother but still i don't know why the idea of putting like the tongue of another animal in my mouth even if to, to consume it kind of weirds me out maybe if i just didn't know what it was then i'd eat it oh sorry it might be hard to get in if we bring a cat along what oh oop. Yep. get in the bag morgana Sendai Sekigan, a Gaiyutin restaurant. Mm. Holy shit. Oh, God. Is this for real? <laughs> Here comes the goofy music. Here we go. Mm. This meat is so thick. Oh, yeah. So soft. Damn, that's good. That's weird, Ryuji. My meat is actually thick and hard and streaming along. Just like Yusuke's over here. Yes, mine is so erect. Good lord. It's massive. Ah! Okay, you're, you're actually just talking about the meat, aren't you, Yusuke? Here. Yeah, he does that sometimes. I don't even when want he eats. to know what his regular diet is like if this is enough to make him cry. Either way, food's delicious. Hey, let me have some too. Shut up, what kind of getting us kicked out? I swear, you are the noisiest cat on the planet. Let's get to split some with you. No, I got toxic. Just sound like he's going meow, meow, meow. <laughs> Not happening. Later, you can share Ryuji. Sorry, kid. Want to? Can't. Don't be such a pig. I'm hungry too, you know. Not so loud, you idiot. Is that a cat I hear? Oh god, this woman's got a face portrait. She must be significant. Kill her. Oh shit. Am I hearing things? I could have sworn I heard a cat. Uh, no, uh, I didn't hear a cat. And uh, how was that over there? Run! Just like the real thing. It's a work in progress. What he said. Yeah. <laughs> it's a work in progress. Oh, come on. You're not fooling anyone. So 
Sounds to me like he's in the bag of the gentleman with the glasses. Oh, that's sweet. Are you going to share? Ma'am, get out of here. You and your cat should partake in the finest beef tongue this restaurant has to offer. Aren't you just a customer? I don't think you can dictate this. What? Jay, not so loud. Oops. Sorry, sorry. You're right. If you get thrown out, then no more beef tongue. By the way, is this your first time having Sendai beef tongue? I should tell you, the oxtail soup's to die for. Oh my god, this lace is so insanely nosy. Oh my god. Oh, this is so awkward. I just want to eat my food in peace, please. Did you know oxtail soup is packed with collagen? Yeah. Some people seem to think it's good for your skin. Yeah, really? That's just fucking great. Oh my god, please leave me alone. They say it's not as effective when ingested, but there's a fair number of reports that suggest otherwise. I'm not gonna lie. If this was actually, if this, if this person was coming up to me in real life and I'm hanging out with my friends and just like some random ladies come to start saying some shit, I'm like, I would literally be like, I'm like, please, please, I just want to eat my food, please. Human cognition can be quite misleading. You may think you feel a change when none has occurred. This is the placebo effect and... Yo, dude, she's just going on and on. Ryuji, I've got a gun in the bag. Dude, are you think- No! I want you to use it to kill me, Ryuji. Do it. Put me out of my mess, Ryuji. Does she even notice us talking right now? This overwhelming onslaught of pointless info. We got ourselves a nerd, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, sorry about, you know, the bag thing. Huh? What? Oh, you mean the cat? Don't worry. I won't tell the staff or anything. By the way, are you all students? We're the Phantom Thieves. We have superpowers and summon demons. Also, we go to high school. Wow, you go to high school? That's so cool. We're in high school. We're in college. Wouldn't you like to know? We're in college. Yeah. Hmm. I could see a couple of you being in college, but not you. You've still got an air of innocence about you. The fuck are you talking about? You have any idea how many girls I've fucked at this point? I mean, what? In which case, you'll be taking your entrance exam soon, right? Have you decided where you're going to apply yet? Oh, forgive me. I haven't even introduced myself. I'm Kuani Jinose. I work as a researcher over at Toho University. You know you got a giant chain on your ear. Hey, you guys should come check out the campus. It's way up in the mountains, but it's a lot of fun. Lots of bears this season, too. Sure. That's, that's probably where our fan uh, palace monarch is. Assuming it's not you. The bears? Bears? Oh, uh, you know, we kind of got something going on already, so we don't exactly got the time. I see, I see. Yes, well, it's important that you do what you want while you're still young. Allow me to impart a little treat till next we meet. I thought, was, I thought she was about to fucking kiss Ryuji or something. Uh, sure. Oh my god. Well then, I've had my fill of beef tongue, so it's probably best if I get going. Farewell, young ones. That was so painfully awkward. I want to die and So, uh, she was weirdly energetic, huh? My, now my food's cold. Great. Fucking great. Well, thankfully, we avoided getting in trouble. We should be grateful she didn't tell on us. Sorry, that was my fault. Yeah, it is your fault. No beef tongue for you tonight. Ah, uh, I got carried away too. Sorry, Mona-chan. We'll buy you some sasa kamaboko later. You mean the fish cake on the skewers with that nice layer of jar on top? Oh, I can't wait. I feel like some of this shit cannot be good for you, honestly, right? Like, don't you, you're like a cat in this world, so technically you have like cat anatomy, so that means that like certain- Shut up and give me the food! Okay, fine, whatever. Oh my god, what the fuck? The latest work was just perfect. I was up on my thing two nights in a row, if you can believe that. Now nah, it's gonna be that guy. Speaking of which, I read in a magazine that he's going to be at the station today. There's no way I'm missing that. All right, let's finish eating. And quietly this time. Yes, ma'am. Beef time was fucking amazing. Anyone else had beef tongue before? Is it good? Is it is it weird? Or does it just taste like regular meat? I am curious. Ooh, I'm stuffed. How you can eat five bowls of rice is beyond me. Is your stomach a black hole or something? Yeah, damn, that's a fuck ton of calories there, Ryuji. Look, if they're offering free refills, then you can bet I'm ordering them. Free refills on rice? Really? That exists in Japan? Oh my god, I need to go there too. Fuck. 
Indeed. You can eat the first bowl and focus exclusively on the glistening of the meat. Then the aroma on the next, and so on. Pretty sure that's just you. Well, I will say the food here certainly is delicious. Yeah! Good job, Sophia! It was, as they say, a piece of cake. Guess we should leave where we eat up to Sophia now, huh? Hmm? What's going on over there? <laughs> hmm? That's my son. Your lady says she was just up me, like you know. <laughs> ah, ah! Oh yeah, I still like sound like people who've gotten the disaster taken, right? <laughs> it was crazy! I love it! I just wanna lick your face! Natsumi-san, over here! Can you please sign my copy? Can you please sign my ass cheeks, please? Natsumi-san! <laughs> Thank you for all your support. Whoa, hold on now. Only one autograph per person, please. Oh, Jesus Christ. This guy's just walking around with fingerless gloves. He's absolutely a psychopath. Oh, my apologies, but could the men please go to the back? the line ladies first you see Who the hell's that he looks pretty popular i heard that woman say latest book does that mean he's a writer well, whoever he is got a serious case of douche face <laughs> oh god he's about to come over and hit on us now isn't he hello there are you looking for an autograph as well or perhaps a handshake. Oh my gosh, he hitting on how roof he is. He's gonna fucking die today. Huh? Um, oh my god. Oh, how terribly rude of me to keep such lovely fans waiting. Please accept this as a token of my apology. Jesus Christ. Yes. Don't worry, I've already signed. I was gonna write up a post to us. Um, okay. Listen, uh, we were just passing by. Ah, uh, is that so? It seems I got a little ahead of myself. Prince of Nightmares by Ango Natsume. Yours truly, Ango Natsume. It's a pleasure. <laughs> so he's gonna come out and be like, Guys, he's right there! He's right there! I smell it! It's super strong now! Prince of Nightmares. That's the name from those flyers on the Masamune statue. My flyers on Masamune statue? Ah, oh, I think I know what happened. That's most likely the work of some of my more zealous fans. I appreciate them promoting my work, but it appears they went overboard somewhat. Honestly, they can be a real handful sometimes. Is that Oda? Is that Oda's voice actor? I.e. Byleth as well, I think. Allow me to apologize on their behalf. In exchange, allow me to offer you a kiss. Yo, back off, dude. Can't you see you're making her uncomfortable? That's enough. Get away, Rock! <laughs> Seriously, back. Get away, Rock! And who are you supposed to be? I'm her boyfriend in another timeline, apparently. I believe I was addressing these lovely young ladies here. I thank you not to interrupt. Mm, sorry, but they're with us. You got a problem, you can always talk to me. <laughs> Do you seriously think you can get away with speaking to me like that? <laughs> Try me. Bring it on. <laughs> My, this one's got some backbone, doesn't he? Mr. Natsume, we need to get moving soon. <laughs> well then, it seems I must be going. I've a magazine interview to get to. To all those who have read my book, I thank you from the bottom of my heart. Natsume! I love you! Delusional fan! Oh, he's just so dreamy. I'll have to buy ten more copies tomorrow to show him just how much I care. Uh, uh, just have to send him another one of my organs. Just love to how much I care about him. Uh. Who was that, man? Man, we should, we should make this easy, right? These, these monarchs just come right to us. I don't know if he was some local big shot or whatever, but he sure was pissing me off. He was a strange one for sure, but the people around him seemed really happy. Why was that? Because the disaster stolen, he's crazy. Probably because they're a bunch of weirdos. I must agree. He wasn't at all deserving of such praise, even in the form of flattery. Guys, why are we so slow in the uptake? Why are we acting like we didn't just go through a very similar instance of this happening? Are you all right, Haru? Mm-hmm. 
I was just a little surprised as all. How did jerk like him get so popular? It doesn't make any sense. Hmm. There might be something else going on here. He could even be changing people's hearts. You mean, he's the monarch of the Sendai jail? It's just one possibility. No, I, I think you might be onto something. If he's the monarch, then everything else totally makes sense. Uh, we need to look into this. Perfect. I got my laptop back at the RV. Should be able to dig something up from there. Mm. That was easy. That Ungo Natsume. We may not have any evidence of him being a monarch yet, but he sure is fishy. Let's go to the camper. We should work out how we want to gather intel on him. Then we can go from there. Hey. God damn it. Fuck you, Morgana. Wow, look how big this place is. Too bad I can't go anywhere. Can I go this way either? Hey. Nope. Because why can't? Why should I? On the road again. Can I still not go on a shop? Let's go. Of course I can't. Killing Morgana again. All right. Let's go over what we know so far. Nothing. Sophia, you can confirm there's a jail here, correct? The smell got a lot stronger once we entered the city. So yes, I'm sure of it. Should have gotten really strong when that guy was up in our face. And the man we met earlier, his name was Ango Natsume? I just did a quick search on him. Here's what came up. Ango Natsume, grandson to renowned writer Sogo Natsume. Currently a successful light novel author. Says the guy kicked off his career with his debut work, Prince of Nightmares, which won the grand prize in the Sokaisha Awards. This thing's selling stupidly well. It sold a million copies alone. A million? That's kind of nuts, right? It's a bestseller. Eh, it's nothing special, give a shit. Are you kidding? It's a borderline miracle. Debuts almost never hit numbers like that, even the really good ones. I checked social media, and, well, this whole thing is kind of bizarre. Natsume's fans are probably going on some kind of rampage, right? There's a rumor that some people got beat within an inch of their lives just because they were sort of dressed like Natsume's characters. Man, that just all sounds pretty normal to me. All right, on to the next city. Right. The worst part is that no one stepped in to stop them. In fact, the attackers were praised for what they did. They were tossing them like maces and shit. These are likely the same kinds of people who defile Masamune's statue with flyers. They clearly lack self-restraint. And the fans at the station seemed really passionate too. It was almost like they were part of a cult. I'm checking some of the online forums. It looks like there's about a hundred threads created about this dude almost every day. And they're all positive. Not only that, but all of these IP addresses are from Sendai. That's crazy suspicious. This is definitely our guy then, right? <laughs> Maybe he's just that good. <laughs> It's certainly possible. But there's still a chance he's our monarch too, ain't there? Bruce is like, I just want, I want to fuck this guy up. Come on. That's what we're going to find out. Tomorrow, we'll go into town and see what intel we can dig up. Only if I get to explore, Morgana. If he's the monarch, then there's a good chance we'll run into some victims who've had their hearts changed, just like in Shibuya. Oh, yeah. We should probably let Inspector Gramps know too, huh? Good idea. He might be able to give us some other clues too. Okay, well, I guess we should all probably hit the hay. We've got a busy day tomorrow. So... Why the hell are we sleeping up top? Might as well be sleeping outside. Ain't it gonna be cramped? There's nothing we can do. There isn't enough room in the car. Besides, it's not as bad as you say. Is that how this works? I have never seen an RV that did that. Never actually slept in an RV before, so. Back when there were more students at the atelier, it was quite normal for us to sleep huddled together due to lack of space. Da 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 da. We're doing some goofy shit. It na 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 na. Man, you always keep cool in the weirdest possible way. You know that? Come on, guys. Are we really just gonna call it a night? Shouldn't we like? I'll be playing cards till super late or stargazing or something? Ain't that the kind of shit we're supposed to do on a big trip like this? Another we do. Just go with it. Sleep is fun. Yeah! You're missing the point, dude. <laughs> Forget it, Ryuji. We're up early tomorrow.
tomorrow anyway, so you better get some rest. Yeah, come on. This, this. Do you think this face just comes naturally? I gotta, I gotta get my beauty sleep. It's gonna be hot as hell with three of us and Morgana, ain't it? Very true. That fur certainly won't help things either. Oh, what do you want from me? I can't help that I'm a cat. Not that I'm actually a cat, though. You are a cat. We learned that at the end of the game. You're just a cat with a weird demon or something. Get over it. Sorry. We decided to turn in for the night. Oh my God, Ryuji, you're right in my ear. Ryuji? Ryuji? Ryuji, I swear to God. I swear to God, there better be a flashlight in your pocket. I swear to God. You scan I'm fine with. Wrong. Not like that. Like this. This. <laughs> To be fair, I'm pretty used to Morgana's at this point. I fell asleep to the sound of everyone's peaceful breathing. Pork chop sandwiches! Ah! We bonded a little bit. But not too much. Awesome! Okay, no more voice acting. All right, made it to the station. Let's score some leads to that smug bastard. Aww. Sheesh, take it down, Arch, dude. You're bouncier than a gray schooler on summer vacation. Are you all right, Fatoma? Are you not a morning person? I didn't sleep much last night. I can't get comfy without using my usual pillow. Hmm. Well, it was our first night sleeping in the RV, so I suppose it's no surprise. You'll get used to it over time, I'm sure. The station is really busy for a weekday. Maybe because everyone's out from school. Hmm. The Shadow Arcade is only a short walk away. The Tanabata Festival decorations are apparently a popular attraction for sightseers. Oh, I see. Sendai's Tanabata Festival is coming up soon. Seems there's plenty of shops to draw a crowd. Perhaps we should try asking around over there. Yeah. Yeah, we'll do the same thing we did with Alice. Let's meet up again once we found something. All right. Tony, you're fucked up. This place got has gotten. Damn, look at all these dramatic angles. Begin investigation. Oh my god, that looks like Tagami in that silhouette. Yeah! But first, I got bomb points. Uh how much I need for this one to unlock. Actually, I may have to level up enough before before I get any more. Uh enables the creation of more food with stronger effects. Cooking level up. Sounds good. I can go even further than that now. Uh Sure, why not? Oh. How much does that uh, LeBlanc Curry heal? 20 SP to everybody. Fuck yeah, baby. That's that good shit. Antenna shop. Take a look. Purifying ass. Slightly decreases jail security level. Oh, interesting. Uh, Hotspot Sendai. A magazine with throwing info about a hentai hotspots. Increases showtime gauge. Is that what you want? Thank you okay. Very much. <laughs> Not sure how that works exactly, but all right. Oh, wait, wait, wait. What a crowd. I wonder what's going on. It feels a bit off, I guess. Mm. It's a big department store. We shouldn't go in there unless we have to. No, I, I want to look at the crowd here. Uh, I guess I can. Utah restaurants. Where we came for the beef tongue. Let's come by back one day. Uh, like right now. So cookie recipes can sold to local shops. Don't miss the opportunity to buy them whenever you find them. If you miss out on any recipes, still possible to buy them from Sophia's online shop. However, beware that obtaining them this way will be much more expensive. Oh, fuck. <laughs> Holy shit, I see it's 20,000 yen for that. It smells oh, delicious. That's oh, that's good. Yes. Tell me how to make your stuff so I can make it even better. Ha ha. Thanks again. Something smells delicious. Maybe try it. Sit down and try it. Wait, are you planning on ordering Gyaten stew? Then allow me to join you. Here, the beef tongue, when softened and stew, is simply divine. I must confirm this for myself. Enjoy e eating Gyaten stew with Yusuke. Superb, truly superb, Nico. Feel flash of inspiration. Yes. Uh. Is that all? Okay, on the go. Gotta get the Thanks stuff to make the recipe my, myself. I wonder if the one I make is just going to be the same here where it restores 50 HP to one ally. There's a bus and a taxi terminal down there. There's a lot of cars here at the station. 
Isn't that ridiculous? Oh my god. He is the chosen one. Yeah, this all seems completely normal. Six huge. Look how far stretch it stretches. What the hell are these people over here doing? Oh, I see you. Hello. Hello. It's a pretty big station. I guess the city's doing pretty good for itself. Look at all these beautiful, eyeless people. That's what you want to interact with. I'm just a weird, faceless NPC. That I... No, I, I counts or anything. I hear them all talking crazy, though. Here what they did to Alice. Who's going to be next? Oh, wait, wait. I see a dude grumbling. Is this the same hat dude from before? Oh my God. Now hat guy is actually, his friend was the one that got fucked up before. Now hat guy's messed up. No. Also, are you following us? Why, why did you me my honey pie? We swore our love to each other here. You told me how special I was to you, so why? What did I do wrong? What? Huh? This is even even related to anything we're doing. Top of this an observation deck. We'll probably be able to see Mount Aoba. 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 Let's go. We'll take you to the shopping arcade. Damn it. The government office and the rest of the office district is down that way. Turn back and head down across the way for the shopping arcade. Oh, shit. <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> really? Dude, I, I can't wait. R really, guys, going to be the final boss of this game. I'm telling you, right? He's going to be the, the most fucked up out of everybody. The most powerful of monarchs. Wait. And I can't okay. wait. Who said to go? She took the stairs down to God damn it! Just as bad as Morgana, Sophia. Oh, Alavanza, what are you? What are you, what are you doing out here? Welcome. Please this way. Get your ass in there. You're in big trouble Welcome now. Damn hey, well, what did I do this Wait, time? What, what ah, all right. Let's go ahead and register everybody. Like reg uh, oh, just register higher leveled ones. Oh, because I picked up a yes, yes, yes. This persona has been registered in cool. Its present condition. That's Please really fortunate. Because this one's a lot easier Awaken to accidentally get personas that are not going to be as uh, powerful as the other ones you got. Hi, it Pixie. That it can gain new power. Pixie's super powerful and has got a crazy haircut. Maguru, Makajama. Uh, I just forget an area of foes. Media. Barith. Rakukaja. Double things, which only hit once for some reason. And uh, Rampage. All right. Choose which skill. Let's go with uh, Punk Fairy here. Behold. I am High Pixie. They don't call me High Pixie for nothing. I'll be your master. You're the real reason why, bitch. It was actually kind of cool. I, I showed, it showed that I actually did not have. um. Uh, the succubus persona, but it gave me the option to just purchase it right away and fuse it. I don't remember if that was something that was in the original Persona 5 or not, that it would just automatically do that. Like you had to go and get it first, and then it would, and then you would be able to fuse it. So I don't have Andras here, but I, if I do this, I can, uh, I'll just buy it right away. So, uh, sure. Choose which. Get over here, Barith. I'm there. There is no need to fear, Master Souls. I wholeheartedly pledge my lord to you as your mask. And so does my trusty steed. Thank you. All right. He is the chosen one. Let's head back. Something over there. So we'll not move out too far away. It's like goofy ass costume he's got on that picture. Oh, wait. Hmm? It's the same one as the one on the statue. Seems like they're everywhere in the city. Check out those things aiming from the ceiling. They look like aliens. They are apparently called streamers. In Sendai, they're known for being topped with large balls called a kusudama. Now I think about it, isn't Tanabata celebrating July? Looks like Tanabata is observed using the old lunar calendar. So this festival is held a, mo a month later in August. Huh? I don't know if I follow you, but whatever. August rules! Yeah! By the way. Kind of crowd here, huh? Like even more than Shibuya. That's the rest gonna be a pain. Chocolate banana, banana stand. Like some chocolate bananas. Hey. Hey. Oh, that's dope. Oh, that's dope. Shit, you want a banana? That's dope. Both. Ah! Thank you, sir. My chocolate sweaty balls. What the heck? Oh, this sucks. Uh, something wrong? Oh, Nico, I was wandering around the shopping area here. Now I've got to switch on the brand, which all these sir shops and food stands around. Temptation's the worst. Ugh. Almost full when I saw a place with the guillotine ice cream that also sells chocolate bananas. Ugh. All right, sorry about that. I should get back to asking around about Asume. Hmm. I've heard his name come up every so often. 
but it's never about his book, just about how people, how much people idolize him. It's kind of weird. I mean, what about Uncle Masume? Uh, you and the rest of society. Everyone's talking about it lately, it makes me sick. Pretentious pricks like that are always hiding something. Her business has been good lately, thanks to all that Nasumi gift merch. Do need to wake up? There are plenty of other good authors out there. I got a whole 2% for that. Thank you, ma'am. We are really well on our way here. It's Japanese sweets. It's good to see you, person I've never met before. Bye. Uh, General Store. Huh, I got Nasumi. Of course I know him. He's like a, he seems like our products. A lot of fans give them to him as a gift. They sell like hotcakes, I tell you. It's all thanks to Nasumi. Ha. Just between you and me, I'm also gotta worry about how much money the fans are spending on all this stuff. Mm. Sound like what was happening with Alice. She had fans pouring in up normal amounts of money too. Get her buy something? Oh, that gave me a huge boost. So what is it that you see? Uh, what in the fuck, dude? Plus 20 SP is 980 yen? This is a steal. Have you made your choice? Have you Thank made you your decision? Oh man, I need this too. Uh, Sophia, open up your shop so I can sell some money so I can get this too. Four plus four agility is good. Holy shit, I can't believe I just 20 SP? That's insanely good. Oh my god, they have a pineapple store. Can I help you find <gasps> Oh my god, show pineapple. 10 SP. I'll take all those pineapples. <gasps> Here's the chosen one. Something is amiss. Look, Nico, the general store over there is unusually packed with female customers. Perhaps just my imagination, but their eyes seem hollow. Oh, I already checked it out. Don't worry. I I got you, man. Your eyes do not deceive you, Yusuke. Yakisoba. Let's say Yakisoba. Yeah, come on. Great prize. Uh, okay. I don't have the animal money. Probably should have spent all that money on nuts before I left on this vacation. Ooh. The store owner is a real, real surprise to learn who Hara's family is. At first, they were all stiff and nervous, and Horace, but Horace too warm for anyone to keep that up for lo so long. She had him singing in no time. It was crazy seeing how people treat the upper crust, let alone Horace's ability to get him to stop. She's so amazing. Oh, hello. I've been asking around the shops here. Apparently, it's a nest in the middle of an assuming fever. Apparently, it's even affecting some of the shop staff. I've heard some complaints that it's getting bad for business. People no call, no showing, or even ditching their shifts part way through to go, go pick up more copies of Nasumi's book. Could it be? Could their hearts have been changed? Oh, I nearly forgot. When I told one of the local restaurants that I was on a trip with my friends, he gave me this. It's a hamburger from a local chain using local ingredients. They say it's very good. A guillotine burger? Oh my god, they got a Big Bang burger here? Oh, thank god. <laughs> this trip is saved. A boot of Kabura Foods can be a good represent uh, representative of regional flavors as well one day. Uh, it's no day and night in space. Would you like to try a guillotine burger? Only available for a limited time. Applies, oh my god, applies the Matarakaja Kaja effect? Oh shit. That's kind of dope, actually. Thank you. Too bad I have no money. Uh, vending machines. Uh, oh, I don't even have for the guillotine soda. At least I got decent sodas here. It doesn't even heal five, it's ten. Damn. They got that good shit. A bibliophile. Look at this bookworm delete her social media account. Is it probably that other you really like? She's been putting out quite a lot of work lately. We should get depressed. You're not supposed to admit how she could tr she's tired of trying to make her voice heard out in a vacuum. Do you think and and go on go Matsumi is the cause? Have you read Ungo's book? The story and the dialogue is just similar to what Bookworm would do. Hey, be careful. What's up with Suga and Asumi's grandson here? You'll get flamed if you talk about him carelessly. Hey, did you hear that? She seems so suspicious of Ungo and Asumi, stealing other people's work. I wonder if it's true or just some rumor. Hmm. Uh, oh, interesting. So he just stole her their work and now, and oh my God, it's fucking evil. So the stuff he's putting out there isn't even original uh, anyway. Fresh ingredients, they're delicious. Oh my God, they look great. I can't wait to come buy this when I have money. Uh, did I walk by some dudes or something? I guess they must have. I'm not seeing too many people to actually listen to. Oh, here we go. Or if you're mad town, you can make a wish at Tenzaku over here if you'd like. Hey, Nico, can you wish so that things will work out between me and Lady On? No, all right, it's not, it's not into furries. Actual literal furries. Dude, where the hell am I supposed to go? Swear to God, I've talked to everybody here. Where's the gossip I'm missing here to finish this? Oh, 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 here we go. Dude, there's a temple here. It's small, but kind of distinguished if you're gonna look at it. Apparently, business come here for good luck. Please support my store, the Sophia shop. Well, maybe if you let me in there, Can damn it. Something. It's the place where also people make wishes, right? How interesting. Oh, okay, I guess not. Probably gonna hope I can actually turn the camera in this area, but for whatever reason, it won't let me do it. The fuck is the last bit of gossip, dude? What the hell? There's gotta be like one more thing somewhere. 
Oh, you fuck. God damn, man. Okay, I guess you need to have a grumble grumble. This Makoto was trying to sort of pull me in that direction. She's looking at the line here. And the line didn't do anything, which that was kind of weird. But it's this girl over here. Who looks like Moshi Rige in a different outfit. And if I ever lost one, then maybe Ango will finally notice me. Then hurry up, this is book signing. What did you say? Sumi's doing a book signing? Search complete. And Sumi will be holding a book signing nearby. And it's happening very soon. Really? Wait, is that why they're all here? Bookstore is in a mall named Porto, and the event starts in one hour. I see. All right, Nico, let's come back here when we're done collecting rumors, which is fucking now. All right. Got plenty until now. I'd say it's safe to call it quits. Remember in Asume's autograph session we heard about? Search just see him in person. Let's do some first party reconnaissance. I'm not done seeing the signs. All right, then. All right, fine, whatever. All right, I am think I'm probably gonna end things here for now after that, because as we saw before, I don't know, I'm like sort of ready to get into like, maybe I'm ending a little early, but at the same time, also, could get into a hopefully boatload of cutscenes here. So let, let's go ahead and save the rest for it next time. Uh, anyway, guys, I hope you all enjoyed this episode. If you did, please do like and a ferret and subscribe if you already become Piggy Penguin. My boy, this LP where the days are always sunny and the vids are always funny. And as always, guys, till next time, stay classy.